Hey everyone, welcome back to Rayman 2, the final episode. Uh, things might look a little bit different. I have full lumps and shit, you might be wondering why. Well, I recorded the final episode. I thought it turned out really, really well. And when I quit the game, it froze and completely busted the recording and everything. And it's corrupt. And because I record in MP4, because it's a more convenient file format, it's impossible to recover. So, yeah. This is the last boss. I am currently re-recording this. Does it not play the cutscenes? Alright, no cutscenes then, but... To give you some feedback on what would be happening... Uh, Globox is captured via the robot. Razorbeard is all pissed because we're winning. Uh, he's about to shoot Globox, Rayman appears and the boss fight starts. This is the boss. Sorry if I am a little bit pissed sounding. That's because I am pissed. Um, not once did I have any problems with recording. Except now. In the final episode or on the final episode when it turned out really well and I was playing pretty well and I was having a good time so yeah now I'm not having a good time well I am because this is still a good game but you know what I mean he's floating on air um, I'm just a little bit pissed but this is what happens if you are interested man this sucks fucking hate recording off of the PC doesn't matter So we're gonna get rescued. Sorry to spoil it. And that looks better than Dark Souls Lava, that's for sure. We get saved by the power of friendship, as always. And there is a walking shell there. And this walking shell is our best buddy. I don't know why, because they were kind of always frenemies, but whatever. God, that's creepy. Her floating head, just without anything else, I don't know. It's the power of hope, not the power of friendship. But, you know, same difference, isn't it? Cool. I don't know why he makes this face. <laughs> Anyways. There's a robot. Alright, so here's the gimmick. You fly around and you have to get these pickups. And with it, you can shoot him down. And then you can come in and hit him a couple of times. It's fairly easy, except he, he does shoot out these tracking uh, shots at you. But they're whatever. They're whatever. Uh, listen, this is a kids game boss. Shit. That I just failed at. Anyways, the thing is, you lose like no HP. HP, I said it weirdly. And this game is turning me into French Canadian or something. That's only on my mind because I watched the credits in the previous recording and this game is made by Ubisoft Montreal so I have French Canadians on my mind. Does this like track forever? Anyways the gimmick here is he also uh, shoots out these 
not shoots out, but he raises the lava. Which again... Fought... I misjudged the distance. Whatever. It turns out I'm gonna be like failing at this boss fight because this is an attempt to... I'm gonna like lose my shit. I should be like more... more... practiced with this. Instead of less practiced. Did I not get it? Cool. Don't worry, he stays down there for a long time, so it's like not... Shit, I didn't manage to get it. If you can grab it, that makes things a little bit easier. That's whatever. Once again... Ooh, shit, I knocked into my mic. God, I'm still not used to this. Again. As I've stated... Fuck, that's still following me. As I've said a couple of times before... Again? Shit. He's never done this twice in a row. That's a bit of a dick move, honestly. It's a bit of a time waster move. I'm gonna be honest with you. A deliberate sabotage. I think so. Okay, can you please fuck off down here? Unbelievable. Seriously? Three times in a row he's done that? Okay, I'm playing with fire. Okay, I got the thing now. You really gotta, like, calm down here so that I can shoot you. Uh, two more reps of this should be enough. There we go. Cool. Ah, oh, why is he doing that so much? I've played this boss plenty of times, believe me, throughout all my attempts. Never once has he done that attack this often. I say that honestly. Okay. If I'm correct... This should be the... No, no it's not. Can't believe that thing is still following me. I cannot believe that happened. I cannot believe I actually died. Uh, this is really making me drag it out, isn't it? Really, really does. To be honest, I did miss a couple of shots, but... There's no reason to like fuck me over like this. So I'm gonna like... Cool. That's what you want. You wanna grab this. And there's a way to get like unlimited ammo, right? I think there's like some easter egg... Where you're able to get... Unlimited ammo, but I don't know how to do it exactly. Oh shit, I'm almost temp tempted to try something.
Because I think what you got to do is like fly up. Yeah, I think you got to fly up while you're holding this into the hole there. There's a hole up there. I think that might be it. Okay, come down here so that I can end this. There he is. Oh, there's still one more. Oh, shit. And I didn't manage to pick up the shot either. That is really, like, ch gonna chase you infinitely. It's kind of crazy. I thought it had like some... This is unbelievable. I swear... I swear there's something going on with this fight because... He sure as shit did not do this on attempt one. Uh, I guess the... Recording failing has completely... Messed up this game. I swear it is being done on purpose now. I'm no longer pissed off though. Uh, as much as I was pissed off at the start, I am no longer... Oh, don't even dare crash. He's dead. Man, that was a chore. More of a chore than previously. Of course he's not dead. True kids game villains can never die. And he's gonna go predator on us. I like the look of that ship though, kind of sad to see it go. I still like how the assets are like the standard building assets that kind of it, it like kind of exploded into. <coughs> Excuse the cough. Unfortunately, Dash Randar was lost in the explosion. The reason I'm making that comment is because I remember playing this game around the same time as Shadows of the Empire and they somehow almost have the exact same ending where you almost get lost in some exploding ship slash station. And the last levels both involve flight. Hey hey, it's basically Shadows of the Empire. And look at this foot, like, going along. Of course we're not dead. And the walking shell made it as well. And the hat dude needs to never ever smile, because that's creepy as hell. Excellent. We get the price, we get the girl, I guess. Interestingly, the game still only counts my win as 99.9%. .9%. I wonder what the 0.1% is that I'm missing. Uh, probably has to do something with the bonus levels. Shit. Sorry for the yawn. Uh, that's the only thing I can think of. But fuck if I'm doing those. No way. The bonus levels in this game can eat a dick, honestly. Nice music though. All in all, despite this difficult last episode, this is truly an excellent game uh, in terms of kids games and in terms of platformers, you know, because this was the height of the platformer, the era when this game came out, and this is one of the better ones. Really good atmosphere, really fun. If you can get your hands on this game, which people have asked where you can get this game, definitely <coughs> do so, because it's a good time, it's a good time. 
Generally, I would say if you're gonna get this game, avoid the N64 version, because that one is a little bit... It's like downgraded quite a bit, um, like noticeably. And I think the PS2 version is not the best. It's almost like a completely different game. There's like an overworld and a different level layout and all that shit, more cutscenes, but it's not as good. It doesn't have this type of charm. And the overworld is like very charming, but the Dreamcast version, PS1, this version, these are all excellent. So yeah, that's about gonna do it. Man, can't believe I'm doing this twice. It's all good though, it's all good. This was a fun game. Uh, I enjoyed my time, hope you did too. Thank you for all the comments, your likes, your views, all appreciated. Uh, next playthrough is gonna be, I don't actually know yet. If you have some suggestions, let me know for now. Thanks for watching guys, and peace out. See you.